everyone so we are going on holiday in less than two weeks and i thought i would show you what we are taking for ellie who is nearly free we're going to florida for two weeks and i know i get a lot of questions saying can you film what you're packing and kind of just show basically what i pack so everything is everywhere there is so much i'm not going to go great into detail but if you'd like to see any of the clothing items definitely check out my latest toddler haul because they're mainly all in there so yeah okay so the first thing is kind of like her evening more dressy outfits um, and I haven't put these in the suitcase yet because I'm kind of, kind of leaving them to the last minute because they'll just get creased so they're still on the hangers and in the wardrobe so there's just a bunch of different like tops um, and then we've got like dresses and jumpsuits just a bunch there um, you can see and a lot of these are going to be for the cruise so obviously we're going on a cruise as well but yeah as you can see there's just a bunch of kind of like evening wear clothes next she is taking two costumes this is her Rapunzel one and she has her Elsa one but I've just hand washed it because she got chocolate down it so that is drying at the moment but there will be two an Elsa one and a Rapunzel one okay next we've got this little bag here um my nan actually got her I think it's from Primark um and she can use she's obsessed with like dressing up and stuff so she can actually use this while we're out there as well um but in here I've just put all her hair accessories because she's loving hair clips at the moment and all that stuff hair bows so there's just a bunch of kind of hair ties clips and then we've got some frozen bracelets um super girly little bits in there so that is what i'm keeping them all in next is this wash bag her nan got her this um i think it is from bean and bargains i could be wrong um i'll quickly show you what's inside i still have to add her toothbrush but obviously she's using that at the moment so the first thing is a roll-on 30 Nivea sun cream. I really like these ones. I think I've got two of these because they're so easy to apply. Um, so I like to take this with me because it's a small one as well. So if we go to the theme parks, instead of taking a massive bottle, I can just take this roll-on one. Um, so yeah, I've got one of them. And then we've got some Cowpole sachets because you never know if you need them. We have some more hair ties and clips. I think I've bought a bit too many hair ties and clips, but we're losing so much. Um, we've got some sunglasses and we also have another pair somewhere. Her toothpaste. Another roll on. And we also have a big bottle of sun cream as well for the cruise because I think we will go through sun cream quite a lot. Um, and then in here, I've put this in a nappy sack just in case it leaks. I'm not going to get it out. But what I've done, I've bought a massive bottle of like baby wash and shampoo from Asda. And it was such a big bottle. I just got these little travel size ones and poured the liquid into them. And I've just labelled it Ellie Body Wash. And there's three in here because on holiday, she tends to have a lot of baths. She might have two showers a day. Um, just to get all the chlorine and obviously you've been sweating and stuff so she does have a lot of baths and hair washes um, but also we're going on the cruise as well so I can just take one of the bottles on the cruise and chuck the others if they're finished so yeah we will probably go through at least two of these um, due to all the showers she has but yeah in case they leak I've just put them in this um, nappy sack um, and then she just has I need to add her hairbrush in here but she's currently using it and we also have this detangling hairspray which is my absolute favorite for her curly knotty hair so that's another thing in there like i said i need to add her brush and a uh, toothbrush next these are kind of like random stuff we have a clip-on fan by dream baby i've had one of these before and um, but we lost it when we moved um, but they're brilliant, you can attach it to their cot, playpen or buggy, which we will be doing. Um, and then we also have these little princess sunglasses. These were from the pound shop. So if she does lose these, they're, you know, it's not a problem. But her other ones were from Monsoon. We have our amazing snoo shade. I can't recommend this enough if you do travel with a baby or a toddler. It's just fantastic. Obviously, um, 
you can't put blankets over strollers because it just sucks in the heat and they can overheat. With this, it's a breathable snoo shade, so it's all dark and cool. When you put it over the buggy, it fits most buggies as well. Um, but yeah, she takes really good naps, and because we're going to be out during the theme parks and it's going to be very, very hot, this will be a lifesaver. This is by Munchkin. It attaches to your stroller. Um, and it's just like a little snack pot so I can put kind of her snacks in there during the day when we're walking around and also her cup or beaker and it just saves her saying mummy can I have this and she's quite independent at the moment so it'd be good for her to reach and grab what she wants and again this is a lifesaver we use this when we went on the cruise and it was just fantastic Next, again, my nan got her this gorgeous little um, bag and it's just neon pink with her initial on it. And again, if we go out for dinner or something, she can just put all her little toys or sunglasses in there because she just loves kind of dressing up at the moment. So I think that was from Primark. Um, but yeah, it's just perfect for holiday. This is kind of like a wet bag. Um, where I can put if she spills anything on her outfits or if we go to the water parks and we have wet swimming costumes or anything we can put it in this waterproof bag I got this when I went to the beaches event uh, as a little um, sorry sandals event as a little kind of thank you gift um, it's by Sun Uavia I think I'm pronouncing that right and yeah it's just fantastic i love the watermelon neon print as well it's just going to be so handy for holiday i've got a few other things from them as well which i will show you this is her little kind of wash mitt thing tinkerbell of course and this is her poncho towel so it's one of them hooded poncho towels i got this from sainsbury's on sale um but yeah this is going to be great for the water parks and around the swimming pool I got this from the pound shop. It's just a kind of blow up beach ball thing. Um, I thought we could take this to the swimming pool one day and again, it was only a pound, so that's brilliant. This is a bib. Now, she doesn't really wear bibs because she's nearly free, but if she's, wear if she's um, having something really messy and also on the aeroplane just to catch kind of like all the crumbs and stuff to make it less messy um, but yeah it's just one of them white ones and it was from the pound shop so I can chuck it if it does get disgusting we have some Audi swim pants these are the size 5 ones um, just for going in the swim pools and the water parks okay over here we have kind of like cardigans so we've got two white cardigans and this is kind of one of them waistcoat fringe ones um, and she has got a hoodie as well which she will be wearing on the way like traveling we've got one pair of white leggings again for traveling or like the evening to go with her tops okay so i'm not going to go into great detail but these are all her shorts so she has cotton ones all different colors and um, like some of them are for daytime so yeah some of them are for daytime and some of them are for evening there's like Deming ones, white and blue ones, um, another pair of white ones and more kind of like daytime around the pool ones. So yeah, there are all her shorts. If you'd like to kind of see where they are from, check out my latest toddler haul and I've mentioned pretty much most of them. Okay, so this is all her swimwear. This is a two-piece set. It's one of them UVA kind of set so these are the little shorts and the little top and then we have a all-in-one uva one from splashabout it's kind of like literally her whole body's covered so this is great for if she's out in the sun these next bits i'm going to show you are by a brand called sun uvavia i think that's how you pronounce it um but they kindly sent me a few things and i also bought some on their website because i had a discount code so i'm so so impressed with all this stuff it's such good quality so the first thing is this rash vest and it's in this beautiful kind of nautical theme with a seahorse there and some starfish um and all this is in size two to three as well and it's got the little kind of ruching at the sides she's going to look adorable and they also have like matching 
frill knickers and stuff like that on their website so if you like anything in this print you can get matching items like this for example which I'll show you in a minute and um, the next thing is this um, float suit this is the patchwork design it is so adorable and very very me and it just kind of gives them confidence in the water because um, it's kind of got this floating aid here um, and it's frilly at the back and like a crisscross um, so yeah this is the company and it, they've all got UPF 50 plus as well which is just amazing this swimming costume which is just adorable I love the print it's very summery with the pink flowers as well and I like that it goes around the neck and at the back it's kind of lower it's really really cute on her and I can't wait to get some photos of her wearing this and then the last thing is this beautiful swimming costume again it's quite similar to the rash vest it's got a little stripy nautical pocket and starfish on it um, and then stripy up the top as well and again it does go kind of lower at the back so that is just adorable and then I got her this one from the Debenham sale um, it's just a frozen swimming costume all her hats so we've got kind of like bucket hats and a little baseball cap and then these are more kind of like um, to protect her from the sun when she's in the swimming pool. Um, so yeah, they're all her hats. Her knickers, she is uh, potty trained but when we do go on long car journeys or we're out majority of the day, um, sometimes I do put a pull up, pull up on her and she isn't dry at night. But at home she is fully potty trained and pretty good when we go out. She does tell us when um, she does need to go away so um, obviously they do have accidents. I've bought these knickers and we have got laundry facilities at our hotel so I can just kind of hand wash them or chuck them in with the laundrette but they're all her knickers. These are all her tops again I'm not going to go into detail because I'll be here forever but there's kind of vest tops and short sleeve tops, strappy tops there's just a bunch of tops here and people are probably thinking I'm overpacking but I've been on a few holidays with Ellie and I kind of know what to pack um, from my experience. Ellie does get quite messy and has like a few changes of outfits every day so this is perfect for me and I'd rather have more clothes than less clothes. So they are all her tops and then we have kind of like beach cover up so I've got two kind of like really lightweight beach rompers so this is her first one it's from Next and um, it's really lightweight and it's kind of like a play suit romper and then again this one is from Next and it's just a little romper I really love this one um, and then this beach dress is also Hello. from Sun Uvavia Uv and it's this kind of like ombre pink sundress and I love the detail around the neckline, it's got like these beaded pom-poms around the neckline and again it's really lightweight and flowy so it's going to be perfect for a really hot summer's day. And then lastly, just a few more bits to show you, these are her like personalised tops so um, I thought I'd leave these kind of separate to show you. So this one is from Malcolm and Gerald and it's got this beautiful glitter heart with Ellie's name and I think she might wear this travelling or um, maybe on the way back. And then we've got this Minnie Mouse uh, top. I spoke about all these in a video um, and I've got the matchy one to this. These are from Rocket and Rose. And then this one which is personalised, dreams do come true. Um, so yeah, they're her like personalised ones. And then these are all her shoes. So there's just sandals, pumps and trainers which she'll be travelling in. Um, so yeah, that is everything I'm packing for Ellie for holiday. Um, I hope you found this useful. Like I said, if you want to know where some of the clothing items are, I will leave a link down below to my haul where most of them is mentioned and yeah leave me a comment if you've got any questions and I'll speak to you soon. Bye!